The free diving setup for the open water training includes a buoy with a rope and the stopper at the rope's end. It was a tennis ball in the old days and now you can buy a special stopper from a few companies. However, there is one more piece of equipment for competitive free diving. It is a bottom plate. The function of the bottom plate is to attach tags, which a free diver is supposed to bring from the unknown's depths to the surface to confirm that he has reached these depths. Using the bottom plate and practicing tack removal is makes sense when you're preparing for the depth competition. The problem with the bottom plate is an extra drag when lifting the rope. However, the bottom plate which I want to show you today has a design that minimizes the extra drag. It is a bottom plate from the 2B3 free diving equipment company. Let's have a look at their website. Okay, here is it to be free equipment uh, website. We're gonna go for the shop, choose equipment, uh, and then we go for the aluminum bottom plate. So what we see here, we see the price, 60 euro. We see the diameter, 200 millimeters. Uh, thickness is a four millimeter. Material is aluminum. Uh, they say that uh, it works with ropes up to 13 millimeters. You can choose the different colors. Here is a pink, orange and silver. Uh, here is a more description about this plate. Uh, they have uh, 30 holes for attaching tags along the perimeter. Uh, in additional information, you also have a weight, uh, less than 200 uh, grams. And if you want to buy this aluminum plate or any other products from to be free equipment company, use promo code Kaizen. And in this case, you're gonna get 10% for all their products. As I said, one of the negative things about the plate is an extra drag when pulling the rope up. However, the company said that the drag is minimized. So let's check it out. So how are we gonna test it? I will pull the rope up from 30 meters uh, on the first day, I'm gonna do it without the bottom plate. And then on the second day, I'm gonna use the bottom plate. And then we're gonna compare the time, which takes me uh, to pull up uh, the rope from the same depths. The whole setup is from to be free equipment company, the rope, the stopper, and the pulley device. The buoy is from the motion of equipment company. Okay, I'm getting ready and start. Okay, now let's put the bottom plate on the rope. Here we are again in the water with the same setup, uh, same depths, 30 meters. I'm preparing for uh, pulling the rope and start. And here is the time for the both setups. Uh, so without the bottom plate, uh, I did two attempts. Uh, one attempt was 31 seconds, uh, and the second was the same 31 seconds. And with the bottom plate, uh, 31 seconds uh, on the first attempt and 32 seconds on the second attempt. So this is the time, uh, how long it took me to pull the rope from 30 meters. Okay, the verdict. A great tool to prepare for the competition and get experienced dealing with attacks. It's light, durable and doesn't create that much drag when pulling uh, the rope up. So it's not compromising safety on your regular training session. The company which makes uh, these plates, uh, the to be free, uh, free diving equipment company, it's a reliable company uh, which making uh, 
one of the best or maybe the best uh, pulleys and the buoys uh, which we are using for many many years so we are completely satisfied they also have a good customer service so usually at least this is my experience when I have some questions, I ask and then I have immediate response. Like I said, we are pretty satisfied with uh, their equipment, uh, such as uh, pulleys and buoys. And now recently we start using their fins. And if you haven't seen the review about their free diving float, uh, check out this video. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, click here.